Hello, Alan from Enduro Engineering here. We've been getting requests from our uh, Shurko uh, riders that they want uh, to take their headlight off at some applications uh, when they're riding a hair scrambler or, or something else. And uh, so we've developed a uh, number plate bracket. So we're going to show you today how that installs. You can be able to get it in two different ways. You'll be able to get a bracket separately and then you can purchase your own number plate and uh, brake hose guide, or we can sell it the, as a kit complete with everything together. Um, that's strictly um, up to you. The number plate actually is off a 2013 CRF 450, and the brake hose guide, just this little guy here, is off the KLX 110. Um, so they're pretty easy to come by, um, so you can make your own choice how you'd like to do that. So first we're going to take the um, odometer off and so this bracket will allow you to still use your odometer and uh, the, any instrumentation that that includes along with uh, your number plate. Um, if you choose not to then uh, that's uh, strictly up to you. So three millimeter Allen wrench here we're going to take and take these two bolts out here that holds the odometer to the uh, existing bracket that's already on there and then we're going to replace it so that our bracket will have mounts for the number plate to attach to it go on the outside of the uh, odometer and uh, to protect that when uh, from roost and things like that so we're going to take and just set that aside i'm going to use uh eight millimeter here two bolts underneath under the triple clamp that holds the existing mount on We're going to reuse those same two bolts for the Enduro Engineering bracket to mount to. You can take and reattach the odometer. So you'll see that our bracket here has a couple of other ears that come off the side of it that's going to hold your number plate in place. This bracket here that we've produced will also kind of keep your clutch hose, electric start wires, and other odometer wires kind of tucked in behind it. Kind of keep them in place. You could always take and twist this up since you're not using your headlight anymore. Tape up those connections if you want to, whatever you prefer. Use our eight millimeter again, tighten this up. And for all you riders out there that have the XC gear Mako 360 mount, you can see that the odometer with this bracket still clears that, doesn't interfere with anything there. Okay, we'll give you a quick look of how we took and modified the CRF 450 number plate. It's got two sets of holes, cut off the back ones, just leaving the front ones. Then we have to drill those out with a 3 8 diameter drill. That'll go, um, that'll open those up so they'll fit over the pegs onto the fender. Then we also had to take and drill couple of holes here, a quarter inch hole for the bolt, a eighth inch hole for the little peg that keeps the brake hose guide so it locks in there and doesn't uh, pivot on you. So we'll just take and drop this now on the pegs of the fender. It's a little strap that can go around the handlebars.
Oops, made that mistake. Let's do it this way. Don't make the same mistake I did and put it on wrong. We want the brake hose on the outside. And we'll take and spread this guide. Fits in the little hole right there. And take and we'll bolt and nut this up here together. Have a millimeter on the front. Ten millimeter on the back side. Tighten that up. We've machined out some little aluminum bushings here that will they rest right inside the number plate. So we'll take these bolts along with this. Two of them from the top. We've inserted some threaded inserts into the bracket for these to thread into so you don't have to have a nut that you would have to hold on the bottom side of it. So it makes a pretty easy install. Those tightened up. Get our little strap lined up here. Kind of go around. It's kind of up to you on these. Um, it's probably not a real big need for it. So you can either use this strap or you could take and take a knife and cut it off there. So that's how we got going with this. And uh, get out, have fun, have a safe ride.